After we've got new developments about this downtown car chase, we first brought you as breaking news at 11 last night. The 10 News breaking news tracker followed police through the gas lamp quarter as they tried to stop the driver on Market Street. 10 News reporter Jared Aarons is live where the chase ended with why police believe the driver led them on such an unusual chase. Jared? Bill, it was unusual because through that entire chase, the driver went the speed limit the whole time and he even stopped at several red lights. He just wouldn't pull over. He drove nearly a mile and a half down Market Street through the gas lamp district before stopping here at Market and Columbia. Officers didn't say why he kept going, but they did tell 10 News he was arrested on DUI charges and he was possibly high on drugs. The slow chase started when they tried to pull him over for speeding. When the driver finally did stop, he told police he had two guns under his seat. They searched the car and didn't find any weapons. Still, they're glad this chase never really got out of control. It's unusual, but a good unusual. I'd, I'd much rather have a pursuit like that. Back here live at Market and Columbia, police say they weren't going to let this slow chase go very much further. They actually put spike strips down at this intersection and also at another intersection north of here just to make sure that driver would finally stop. Live downtown, Jared Aarons, 10 News.